Good morning, you guys. You're watching my real life vlogs, so let's go ahead and get into it. So it's been a mess of a week. I gotta give y'all all the updates. <sighs> I'm barely making it by the skin on my teeth, hon. So I took my braids out, right? My hair still with a little bit of conditioner in it underneath this bonnet. So I need to take a shower and get that out. We have been sick all week, me and Ann. We had some kind of stomach virus. She was throwing up, I had diarrhea. I know that's TMI, but oh well, it is what it is. And you know, it's always fun when a little kid has nausea and vomiting because they always make it to the toilet to throw up. <sighs> So I'm chasing her around the house with buckets. She's thrown up all over the place. And so obviously that was no therapy all week. So she's been home with me. I've been kind of just on the couch watching Netflix. Something that I actually never do. It felt super weird. I'm really behind on work. I'm behind on communication. I'm behind on emails. I haven't been talking to you guys at all. I haven't been saying anything on Instagram. I've just been in this funk of really, really feeling like a piece of crap. So I'm finally coming out of it. It's the end of the week, so I'm just gonna take you guys along with me through my weekend. I wasn't gonna vlog this week, but I'm like, you know what? I'm feeling kind of better, so I really don't have an excuse not to. So I'm just gonna take them along with me on my like illness recovery, so I don't know. But I need to get cleaned up. I feel gross, my house is gross. It needs to be disinfected, it needs to be dusted off, and all that stuff, so it's gonna kind of be Hopefully a productive weekend. I got a bunch of new PR stuff, some of it I gave away, but I do wanna try this Bare Minerals Peerless Skincare Collection because my skin, I feel, has been kind of suffering a bit, just being a little dehydrated with the diarrhea, but also I just really have not been putting a whole lot of effort into it. So I'm gonna try this stuff, so let's see what we have. So it comes with a cleanser and a moisturizer. Huh, it's a soothing light moisturizer. So yeah, I'm just gonna try this out this morning. I also got a package from Eco Savers with a deodorant and underarm detox mask. So I'm gonna be trying that out soon too. So yeah, also you guys, my camera got fixed. In my last vlog I was telling y'all that my camera had gotten broken and all this drama around the camera. But it turns out when I went to Best Buy to buy a new camera, right? I was shopping for it, I was gonna go ahead and upgrade, like whatever. Um, I only had this camera for not even a whole year yet, I don't think, maybe a year. Um, so I'm looking at the, you know, the features and things on the uh, cameras and as I'm getting ready to make my final selection, I'm thinking, oh, I need to get a protection plan because what if something happens? And then all of a sudden, it hit me. I have a protection plan. <laughs> So I stopped the buying process right in its steps and went straight to customer service like, hey, yeah, so um, my camera is broke and y'all need to fix it. So anyway, I brought the broke camera to them at Best Buy and it was fixed in like three days. So I got my camera back fully fixed. So we're back in business. The downside to that is that I didn't get to upgrade, but that can wait. The camera is only a year old, so I'm just going to make it work for a little bit longer. You guys ask me a lot about my skin routine because some of y'all think I have really good skin and that's super flattering and I appreciate it, but but I don't really have any like secrets to report because I actually don't um, do much of anything special to my skin. I have my dad to thank for his wonderful skin genes. I don't think my dad has ever even had a pimple in his life. I definitely took after his side of the family, me and Alex, the most out of everyone. Okay, so I'm about to try this cleanser real quick. Y'all, Ann is downstairs uh, having her breakfast. I just went to check on her in between cuts. <laughs> um, and she's doing great. She's having some oatmeal, peanut butter toast, and banana. I'm so excited to see her eating. Because we've been struggling with her eating all week. She's been eating pretty much apples and drinking water. That's why I wasn't like really, truly alarmed because she was drinking lots and lots of water and she was peeing a lot. So oftentimes when toddlers or really little kids get sick and they're throwing up and stuff, those are the things you wanna look for to make sure that they are drinking liquid or fluid and urinating. Because if they're not doing one or two of those things, then you have calls for alarm and you should probably take them to the doctor. So I knew the AM was okay. I knew that the um, bacteria or whatever that was was flushing through properly because she was deaf her internal plumbing was definitely on point and so was mine so we made it through we're just kind of getting our appetites back and getting back into the swing of things and her personality is back she's back up running and things like that so i'm just rinsing off this facial cleanser you guys i don't leave my cleansers on for any amount of time i get it on and i get it off and i try to be gentle with my skin especially around my eye area 
Okay, so that's the cleanser. Feels really nice. Let me just say that. It actually feels really nice on the rinse off, so I like that. I always look for how it feels when I'm taking it off. This is made with coconut and prickly pear. Hmm, I had prickly pear for the first time in a beverage when I was in Arizona. Okay, so next I'm gonna try the Soothing Light Moisturizer. All right, I like the pump. I haven't even gotten in the shower yet, but I want to do this right now just to see. Okay, so first impression, I put on too much. What did the directions say? Didn't really say how many pumps, but yeah, four is definitely too much. Absolutely only needed one pump, so it's kind of oily feeling. Not even oily, just kind of greasy. It feels kind of greasy. Definitely not a light moisturizer by any means, in my opinion. All right, I'm gonna pluck some hairs out of my face and then I'll be back and let you guys know how it feels once it's fully absorbed. All right, I went to check on Anne again. She's doing fine. And I'm back after a few minutes to let y'all know that this uh, moisturizer still feels a little greasy. So in conclusion, I always appreciate when companies send me stuff. So I'm very appreciative and grateful for the products. The, the cleanser is great, but the moisturizer is just a little greasy. I would absolutely not want to use this before putting on any makeup. Um, but if you have extremely dry skin, this is perfect for you, like maybe um, on a makeup free day or something when you just want to really treat your skin But for somebody with combination skin like me whose skin is a little bit in the middle between dry and oily I don't really have a super dry problem and I really don't have a super oily problem This makes me feel like it's giving me an oily problem. But anyway, yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and get in the shower because it's time <laughs> You're a big girl. You're a big girl. Just got her temperature taken. Had to go under the arm because she wasn't having it. And we had to get her um, heart rate and blood pressure and everything checked with that thing. You did it, Anne. Big girl. You're a big girl. <laughs> you have a little TV up there. I haven't seen that. That's new. That's new. 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 Is it new? New. You see the dark? Oh, yeah. What you like, honey? Dog. You like dog? It's a finger yeah. puppet. It's a finger yeah, puppet. A finger. Yay. Yay. <laughs> okay. Okay. It's a sequence pill. Here. It's a heart. Heart. toes it's just a big piece of brioche you should love that and some fruit you want me to cut it up <laughs> you want me to cut it up put the doily down girl put the doily down and i got an avocado salad come back in come back come back come back <laughs> one got these for us for you okay perfect thank you i really love this chest <laughs> so cute Come on. This way, this way. Okay. 
Before we get started, are you ready? Hold on, Ian. Look how we look.
Okay, all done. Look how sparkly. I love the way it smells in here. I love the way it looks in here. Yes. Yes, ma'am. Got that out the way. Okay. I jumped in the shower myself and changed clothes and everything. Cleaned up the whole house pretty much. Didn't really expect to do all of this. Anthony actually started off cleaning. He had already gotten up and fixed Ann her breakfast and I had kind of slept in a little bit and I woke up and he was already cleaning. So I just got right into the groove, right into the mix. And together we just cleaned the whole house and it looks amazing, it smells wonderful. And we saved some money, we didn't have to hire anybody, so that was good. Clean out the closet a little bit, put all my laundry away, so I love the way my room feels. Nice and clean, <laughs> it's a good feeling. So now it's kind of like the afternoon, and I actually do have some errands to run. I do need to go to Costco, I do need to go to the grocery store, but I don't know if I'm gonna do it today. I need to though. But I know Costco is gonna be a madhouse today. I'm not really looking forward to that. Oh, look at you guys. Look at you guys. <laughs> and woke up from her nap and ate some pizza. You had your pizza? Anthony, what is this? So I finally figured out what I'm gonna do for her um shelving on this wall right here you guys for the fireplace i discovered a cool idea on was it pinterest must have been pinterest and it's not i'm not going to do the full in black bookcases i'm going to do something different it's going to involve some small cabinets here and some floating shelving here that i know home depot has so that's what we're going to do with that i had a smoothie it was kind of good though i made it with strawberries and bananas fresh and then I used vanilla flavored almond milk. And then I used some vanilla flavored um, plant-based protein. Y'all know this stuff from Whole Foods. And I added, what's the name of this cereal? Turn this way. Yeah, what's the name of this? Is this Life? Anyway, it tastes kind of cinnamony a little bit, kind of weedy. Anyway, I put like a fourth of a cup of that in the smoothie and crunched it up. Only because I was giving Ann some as a snack and she kind of messed over it and I was like snacking on it myself because I didn't want it to go to waste and then suddenly I was like, let me just put it in my smoothie. It seems like it'll be a good fit. And you guys, it was really good. I liked it. It didn't taste soggy at all. It just blended all in and tasted kind of, it was real satisfying. It just made it taste like really rich and stuff. So that's what I had. I'm just glad we're not sick anymore. I'm glad we got all that sickness disinfected out of the house and everything. Everything's clean now and we feel better and so as we jump back into the work week i'll be a lot more you know well and motivated to be productive and things so yeah that's our little story <laughs> and i'll talk to you guys in my next one bye